Shucks, I don't think I've ever been this nervous. Straight up, real talk. He's probably the biggest star we've ever had on the show. Please give it up for your man, Justin Bieber. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Just as we did that, he took a sip of water. So up to you. Uh, man, Justin, you know what? Congratulations. Mad respect. I know that you know when it, when it debuted, it was number one, and that was your first number one. Yep. That's our favorite song. Thank you. Man, that's so good. <laughs> Thank you. Um, if, if you need us to stop playing The Weekend, The Hills... We no, got you, no, bro. I love that song. We got you, though. Yeah, no, it's a good song. We can call our people. They can call those people. <laughs> Get is, this, the is this the the first song you've co-produced, or you know, are you used to working the boards? Is that is that what it means when you work with MDL? Um, no. So basically, um, co-producing is uh, is not working the boards necessarily. It's it's uh, what's it called? Um, just the layout of the song, um, stripping it down, or it's like Rick Rubin. He comes in and it's not like he is actually laying anything down. He's just saying, hey, put this here, take this out, put this here. So that's producing as well. So you don't actually have to be on the board. Yeah. But um, there's quite a few songs on my album where I am on the board. So You must get so many guys offer music to you that they think would be good for you. How, how, do, you, how do you go through and say, nah, that's, that's not going to work for me? I don't really... I don't really take demos. Oh, really? No, I yeah. really don't take demos. So you've never been walking down Venice Beach and someone's giving you one of those CDs and you're like, nah, <laughs> no, Paul, that's not no, for me. I just, I just don't take demos. So yeah. if anyone's going to give me a demo, know that I'm probably not going to take it. Yeah. <laughs> so you just finished your album, right, just a few days ago in Aussie? Yeah. How hard is it to actually just finish the album and be like, it's done, no more touch-ups, no more it edits? It is. It's just because it never feels like it's done, mm. right? Yeah. It just never feels like it's quite good enough. And... um you just have to get to a point where you're just like fine with it and so i'm at the point where i'm just like it's it's good as it's gonna get for right now and i just want the world to hear it who do you show it to like do you show it to your mom you know do you get a few friends around i show it to all the people in my circle yeah. and all the people who i respect and care what they think um but at the end of the day i don't really take what they say and it doesn't really matter to me because mm. everyone's creativity is their own creativity so uh -huh. If you don't like it, that doesn't mean that this person over here is not gonna like it. Yeah, it's just yeah. a personal preference. Have you so. got um, some sort of way where you figure out where you listen to a track and you and you go, "This is it. This is the song." Like, um, what, yeah. what ticks the boxes for you? I think uh, with "What Do You Mean" when we heard that, when we wrote that, it was more so of a, like, yeah, this is this is gonna work. This is like feels good at radio. They feel like it's it's catchy. Cause you wanna you wanna reel them in. You mm. want you want a first song to be so in your head that you can't get it out, right? And I felt like that's what it, what that was. And then I can give them a follow up song that's more creative and more like edgy and more. But you have to like reel them in. It's like with uh, with Justin Timberlake. Uh, I think it was Sexy Back. Yeah. Mm. Um, when he released that, and then he was able to come back after that with um, what was it? Uh. uh or what, what goes around comes around what goes around comes mm -hmm. around and that yeah. was more like dun, 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 yeah. dun, 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 and it was just more edgy and and i feel like that's that's where i'm at right now mm. man as you can tell like no one here other than lily has got abs on the show <laughs> right it's all right don't worry about it but you, yeah i mean bro but oh, i mean yeah, in that yeah, video yeah. hey let's be real come on that video man that girl was licking your abs oh my God, we're never so gonna hot. know what that feels like <laughs> so we've got to live through i know man i don't tell my wife that okay but you know she's she's banging a babe yeah yeah for sure. so you know like obviously nate and i will never get an opportunity to know what that feels like to get your abs like yeah i mean what was going through your head as that was going um, down there was a lot of really intimate sexy moments during that video um but it's just like at the end of the day it's work it's a job so yeah. it's like um did you, have did to you guys take really believe me right now? Because I know sure. you co-produced it, I know you probably. Let's do that scene again. Yeah, yeah. can I'm we like, do that you know scene what? again? Run that back. I don't think I gave my best. <laughs> I, I watched the video with uh, with my girlfriend, with my partner, and yeah. we're sitting there on the couch, and I thought, man, he's so lucky. Mm. Nothing just, happened, man. Have you got any tips for me to try and get my? Like, I don't I'm, know if it's luck, though, dude. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, it just put me to bed. Did yeah. you? Did you? Do you get to pick those girls in in those videos? Like, is that is that like a role that you like to take? Up, like that um, you like? Yeah, to... I like to be a part of that process. For yeah, sure. mm. yeah. Shucks, I mean, it must not be hard. I mean, look, we got like a ton of girls outside. Yep. I mean, what's the cue like when you're doing something like that? 
What do you mean? What like is a queue of people. Like, do you do those open auditions like you see on Craigslist where people uh, just so, line so up? So they just give me like a couple options and yeah. then I just like choose my favorites. And <laughs> Tell then, the ladies, ladies of New Zealand list. what Usually is your type. Usually we have two yeah. finalists and then yeah? Yeah. they actually, we put them in a ring with baby oil. Can I get a mic I'm just <laughs> Exclusive. Exclusive. <laughs> Um, bro, you know, like, you know, with a crowd outside, I know this, like, it must be so hard having just people follow you all the time. Yeah. To be honest, that would, like, piss me off. Mm. But I know you handle it like a pro. But what happens if you need milk? Like, if you need to go up the road and get sugar? Uh, like, do you have, like... Th- yeah, I got, I got how do you assistance. Do oh, okay. right, I got assistance, so they'll go and get me milk for me. 10% yeah. usually. Yeah. Yeah. You do go, show me the receipt. Like, I want to see what the change is. Yeah. Like, um, Give me the change. No, I trust them. Yeah. <laughs> Does it, is that the same with like Christmas shopping? Because I was like, man, imagine what it's like, you know, to go out, buy your friend something nice for Christmas, your mum something nice. I mean, mm. do you have to get your assistant to do that too? Um, no, usually I, I want to be a part of that process. You know, I want her to feel like it's from my heart. Or, mm. or I'll say, this is what I want. Could you go grab this for me? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Because then someone would get and be like, did you buy this or did your assistant yeah, buy yeah, this? Yeah. 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 You Man. must be surrounded by a whole bunch of stuff like material possessions. What, like if your house was to burn down, God forbid it doesn't, right? Yeah. And you had to run out with one thing. Yeah. What would, what would that be? Probably my, uh, my computer because it's got all my stuff on it. Mm. Like my important music and ideas and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, if we can kick it like old school, like take it right back to when you you did the Stratford like talent show, like the the singing yeah. competition, yeah. and you came second. Yeah. Who was the person who beat you? And do you reckon they're still running their mouth now? Name. I don't remember her name, but yeah. I'm sure that's her claim to fame. Yeah. Right? Mm-hmm. Telling all her friends, Yo, like, man. I beat Justin Bieber. <laughs> <laughs> Which, do you yeah. remember the song you sung for that? Do you remember? I sang a bunch of different songs, but my favorite was So Sick. So Neo. By Neo. Uh, yeah. Oh, Dude. man. Let me tell oh, you a story. One. You don't need it. Okay. Okay. Tell me. Tell. My man here um, <clears throat> thought he had a bit of talent and like god bless him he entered x factor this year <laughs> it was and, he, sad, and, he, and he and he and like legit sad, it wasn't bro. a joke you sang so sick yeah man so sick did you do it as a joke or you nah, did he, did really it he said I mean, it was a joke but you, yeah. you knew it was for real yeah. dude i got four no's man <laughs> and i was just like i was just doing this for a joke anyway but deep down, I walked off that stage just going, man, my parents are going to be so embarrassed. I'm, I'm, I'm not a hugging type of guy, but I had to hug this guy at the end because he was... Uh, yeah. he yeah, it was yeah, bad. Yeah, yeah. Didn't even make TV. So sick so of love time. songs. So tired of tears. So done with wishing you were still here. Yeah, I'm so sick of love songs. So sad and slow. So why can't I turn off the radio? Hey. You probably can't even tell who's sung yeah. right. right. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Stupid love songs. Oh, hey, yeah. don't make me think about her smile. Ooh. Having my first child. Letting go. Turning off the radio. So sick of love songs. Oh, oh no, no. Was that the best to it you That was started? you singing. That was me singing. The whole time. Man, <laughs> give it up. See, thank you very much. Video to prove it. Video to prove it. Oh, Justin, I know. What is this? Yeah, I know, right? We bought you a little present, okay? And, man, it? you already done it. But, man, I just thought, can we... Ta-da. Do some karaoke, oh, bro. Oh, yeah, let's do it. Yes. <laughs> what, what, We've been playing with this I all mean, we, day. We, we, we didn't want you looking through the book because, man, you're a busy dude and you got hardly any time. So we narrowed it down and we got... Where's the, where's the paper? What sure. is the Craig David song? Uh, Craig, fill me in. Uh, I mean, I we can... I remember that one. We got boys to is men. The, um, I'll make love to you. Just fill me in. Uh, I'll Can see you in the next yeah. 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 We got baby. Yeah. Oh no, boyfriend. Let's try it. Okay, yeah. let's, let's do try it. Some Craig three, one, four, three. Check, check. Three, one, four, three. All right, here we go. Let's do this. Justin Bieber. Karaoke exclusive. Yeah, we're backing vocals. Okay. Me and Nick will be practicing all day. Yeah, straight up. I don't know if this is the. Can you feel? Yeah. Come on, yeah. All right, yeah. Let's talk about. So I said, come on. I was checking the girl next door when her parents went out. The phone said, Hey, boy, come on, ride around. 
So I knock on the door, she was winning in a bottle of red wine, ready to pour. Dressed like one night Saturday, lace to the floor. So I went in, then we sat down, started kissing. So we jumped right in. All calls that birdie to answer phone. Please leave a message after the tone. I mean, I mean, our parents were kind of cool, but they were the fine line between me and you. We were just doing things and people in love do. Parents trying to find out what we hey, were up to. Hey, hey, why were you creeping out late last night? When I see two shadows moving in the bedroom, like now you're dressed in black. When I left, you were dressed in white, and you feel me? Whenever the ghost is clear, she asked me to come out. I said, hey, girl, come on, ride around. So she knocked on the door. I was standing with the keys in the hand, moving four by four. Jumped in my ride, checking that nobody saw. And the club ain't got that bounce to the rhythm. And I saw it was early morning, thought we'd be early even. So I gave you my jacket for you to hold. Told you to wear it, cause you felt cold. I mean, I mean, I didn't make the rules, but they weren't none to die for fools. Yeah, make up. What? We were just doing things young people in love do, but parents trying to find out what we, we go. were up to. Singing, why were you keeping out late last night? When I said, we knew that it took his name and then I fall. The girl turned her name and went to Fortnite. Can you feel me in? Can you feel me in? Fill me in, can you fill me in? All they seem to do is be checking out on you, baby. Yeah. I don't know this part. Is this like a dance break? Watching out every move, thinking things and tight up crew, baby. Um, I'm assuming this that one day you're gonna be a dad, right? Yeah. So picture this: we got either Justin Jr. sitting on your lap or little Justine sitting on your lap. <laughs> yep. When they say, "Dad, what was the best part about your teenage years?" What would you say? I would say, um, best part of the teenage years. That shut off perfect timing. Time yeah. to her, right? I was like, we're getting deep. It's on yeah, we're getting deep. Um, <laughs> deep. What was it? Owning a Ferrari. No, not that. Going deeper than that. Sickest than part that. when I was. Probably my relationship with my ex girlfriend. Oh, shit. That's deep. Mm. That's deep. That That's was on beautiful. the list of things we're not allowed to talk about. Yeah, well, so we're not going to talk about it, but I'm just going to say <laughs> yeah. that yeah, and we'll yeah. leave it there. Yeah, the man. Bro. Hey, truly appreciate your Thank time you. hanging man. with us, brother. Justin Thanks. Bieber, everybody. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So nice to meet you. Yeah.